first when the cow walks in the robot. Every cow has a color with a responder on it so that the robot knows who she is. When she puts her head in the grain tray, the robot can tell which cow it is and it'll start dosing her grain based on who she is and how much milk she's making. As she eats her grain, the robot arm will come underneath the cow and will start brushing her teeth for the first time with brushes with disinfectant on them. Throughout the milking process, she'll be dosed grain according to her stage of lactation and pounds of milk she's making. So after the initial brushing, the brushes will swing back out. They're disinfected with a peroxide mixture with water and they'll swing back underneath the cow, clean the teats a second time, and the second time after each teat is cleaned, they're blown dry with air. Once all four teats are thoroughly cleaned and dry, the, arm, the brushes will swing out of the way, the arm will come underneath the cow, and the laser will start to scan the teats to determine the coordinates of where the teats are, and the robot will attach pumps one at a time to the teats. The robot will remember the teat coordinates for the last 10 milkings, so that as it scans the teats, it already knows where they should be. Once milk flow is sensed in all four quarters, the brushes will disinfect with peroxide an additional time so it's ready for the next cow. On our robots, we utilize circle pulsation so that all four quarters of the cow get pulsation at a different time to keep a more uniform vacuum level instead of typical pulsation which is two teeth at a time. The circle pulsation much more uniform. As the milking process goes on, most cows don't have equal quarters right across the cow. So with the robot, one teacup is pulled off at a time. So you don't have any quarters that are over milk or under milk. Once all four quarters are done, the robot's teeth are sprayed with a disinfectant teeth dip. The front gate will open so she can exit the robot. The robot arm comes out from the cow, goes back to its home position, and the cluster is cleaned with steam and then cool water. And the robot's ready to milk another cow.